All right, guys, welcome back to some more of uh, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. As you can see, those big motherfuckers are just like, I spawn in and they're just chilling there. They're like, oh, yeah, we know you're coming here. Run, my man. Oh, shit, they come and run, run, brother, run. Run like your life depended on it because it does. How are we going to fight all of them at once? Oh, whoa, 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 okay, we gotta run, 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 we gotta find, oh, there it is, there's the path. Or oh, here's a path. Whoa. At least they don't come up, so... Hey, BD, in here. Jesus, you bu you bitches, like, come on. Now, BD! Fuck off, you pieces. Help, BD. Okay. Mind me out. They are pieces of shit. Let's at least get this, you know? Okay, BD. What is it? Rover. New poncho. Okay, we got a new poncho here. Rover. We'll stick to this one. And eventually, I think we gotta go up there, but something's up there, so we're gonna go. Go on, what you see here, scan it. Nice job. A Wookiee horn, a handcraft wash horn inlaid with precious metal and stones. The intricacy of the design suggests it was owned by a Wookiee of great importance. For generations, the Wookiees made a pilgrimage to the top. The tree guided them. It was more than a tree, a sacred source for the plant. It gave the Wookiees guidance. Uh, I think we can just come down here. And then we this is the path we take. We are like in the last episode, the ninth sister was chasing us down, but some kind of dragon or something took her down. So, you know, we're good with that. Hopefully she gets taught a lesson. Come 
a little insect. Put you into well, this game throws like sometimes this game throws too much bullshit at you, you know. Hmm. This looks like we can climb it, yep. Oh shit. So we gotta time that pretty good then. Shit, we did that wrong. I haven't played the game for so long, you like, kind of forget these controls. Okay, that wasn't uh, anything to do with the controls. We go again then. Right here. Oh. Oh. I don't know. Somebody told me that thing ain't that thing ain't friendly, my man. Oh. Always finding stuff. My friend, as Tarful let us hear, he spoke of a glorious creature called the Shield. That's what it is, the shield bird. It might be a friendly then. Oh! What in the world? What in the fuck happened here? Change realms or something. Wait. Oh, we're gonna learn something. Just keep failing, Master. Do you? Good. Keep failing. Keep getting back up. That is the only way to succeed. I like how they made him into a little kid. Weighed down by ego and pretense. Let go of what you fear to lose and rise up. Now. Again. All in the air. Good. Now reach my position. You can do it. Just gotta keep getting back up, BD. As long as we get back up, we're still in this fight. Should I flip? I'm finally back to where I was before the purge, before Master T'Pol died. All right. Finally, we learned to double jump. Now connection, new skills available. Okay, these are pretty good then. All right, we got our save point then. I wonder if we're supposed to. Oh shit, look at this. We're gonna do one more time. Do we have something up there? Oh no 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 no. We we lost our we lost our pull, okay.
Okay, so we gotta jump. Run that wall, okay. Come on. Bingo. Solid. Oh, oh, oh. We can help it. Oh, my days. Okay, we gotta take that. Okay, we gotta go to the data bank. Cause shit, cause this is the thing I think we got recently. Got it, okay. Okay. Characters. Ah, uh, Guerrero. What else did we learn? Oh, interesting. Cordavo's journal. Okay. I think this is we just climb up, right? Yeah. Oh, look at that. We got item over there. We got item over there, okay. Who I got in here, BD? Need to know, don't you? What you got there? Re Kashak. Kashik. Tree. Some type of test. Okay. Interesting. So we came up all the way here. Moreover, we have to grab this. What do we do over there? That's a question now. Can I jump over here? Doesn't look like it. Oh, 
Oh, we can. Probably just have to jump. Oh, hello. Good job, BD. Tack. Tack is a tree dwelling primitive native to the planet of Kashyyyk. These friendly creatures can often be found on the ground searching for overpried fruits. They searching for fruits. Oh, new pilot's outfit. Oh, we're gonna go all orange here. Oh, something that stands out a little, right? Look at that. Crazy how this tree is being, this log is being like all together. Oh, there's some crazy shit. Did any of it matter? <laughs> um, I'll be shitting me, mommy. Okay, we gotta go to that one. Is that a save? Just see it is. Too bad they don't let you like teleport between these save points. I mean for a lot of backtracking it would uh it would be pretty nice. This bird might be the last of its kind. We made it. Okay, how in the world? Damn, we met this. So our birds are rarely seen that they were once thought to be creatures of legend. A shy bird body shape and feathers enable it to glide across long distance without expending much energy. Since the shy conserve energy so well, it rarely leaves its nest and exerts, say, a typical adult may hunt once per week. Their diet of slugs and what is that? Led to its uh, disintegration as a protector of both the Wookiees and Washer Forest, catching a glimpse of the Shio as a, as a rare blessing that guarantees peace for the viewer. Rob, buddy, no worries. Something interesting? <clears throat> 
never have I seen a view more exquisite than atop this tree. The climb has given me time to reflect. It was a will of the force that I found Bagano. That I am here now. There is a greater journey ahead. Right. Yep, there you go. Let's see what you found. Well, let's see this paint job. We have that right now. There's Starfighter. Well, this might be a little bit good. Okay. Well, where do we go then from here? No bird. You gonna take us somewhere? Oh no, we go this way. Oh, there he is. <clears throat> You're giving us a lift. Oh. There's still so much the Empire hasn't touched. That's beautiful. Like he knows exactly where we wanted to go, and he he Beauty, dropped. Beauty. Let me see. As far as there's, isn't there any other colors here? Look at that. Let's go up. Something. At last, I found my quarry. The Astrium, used by the Zepho sages millennia ago. I hold in my hand a piece of galactic history. Never be able to thank Tarful enough. Do you know what this means, my friend? 
No need to return to Darthamir. Darkness clouded every attempt at finding the Astrium inside Kujit's tomb, but the Force... The Force has provided a new path. Kujit's tomb. Multiple new entries. Okay. Oh, what? Well, we have one more thing here. Okay. I'm the hurting this world i don't know what's got second sister thinking you're so important she likes her souvenirs but i'm not in it for the memories and honestly you're not worth my time so let's make this quick oh bitch one go for a Jedi. Is there a difference? Oh, shit. Which we got? Oh. No train to save you this time. Ah, I thought you put up more of a fight. Yo. BD, here. Get over here. We're not done. Oh. Aren't 
Shit. We are both on our last hits, you know. Being an inquisitor taught me no setback is too great. When you've already lost yourself, a limb's easy. You know, I was a Jedi. It'd be fun to bring you in. Watch you act <laughs> like the rest of us. Oh, angers you. Just wait till the isolation, torture, mutilation, and your friends! I won't let you touch them! You can't stop the Empire! I can stop you. <laughs> Just took down an Inquisitor. Oof. Glad you're okay. We should get back. <clears throat> See, your and Grease are expecting us. Ooh. What a time. Nine sister defeated. Thank the Lord. All right, let's go back and see what's. Oof, okay, so we got to go all the way back. He did learn double jump, so... The Jedi is here. Oh. Down, boy. Some help. Let's head out. Well, this is a shortcut, so Okay, there you go. Maybe we were supposed to wait here for a bit. A bit odd if you ask me. 
But this is probably gonna take us like... That's what we are, we are Jedi. No, no, my band, we gotta go. Oh, wait, we gotta go, actually. Come on, BD. BD, think you can charge this? There you go. Come on. Oh, now we can double jump, right? Aha. Hey, BD, what's this? Let's see what you found. A new mantis paint job, bounty hunter. Let's see. I see you. Do you? Oh. I'll need to really relax. Oh. Did we never get that down there? Looks like we didn't. This Wookiee died from toxic fumes. The Empire is poisoning the planet. All right, we made it back. Now, let's let them know about what's good. Where are they? They're inside? Cordova believed the key to the vault is on Dathomir. You find your Wookiee? Yep. Things are bad down there. Empires everywhere. Inquisitors? Altrilla, the second sister, is gone for now, but she's still chasing us. I defeated the ninth sister. <laughs> Cal, when I was captured by the Empire, I resisted. I swore to myself that I would die before I would talk. But then this dark shadow came. And he was worse than any nightmare I could have imagined. And I still fought. But in the end, I came apart. And I gave them Trilla. And I know there's nothing I can do to make that right. But Cal, there's still a chance we can save the others on the holocron. Hey, look. The Ninth Sister said something about becoming an Inquisitor, like, like it's inevitable. But you went through the same thing she did, and you didn't join them. Cal. It's okay, Seer. We'll find Cordova's holocron. Hey, get your lasers off my lunch. He's just looking at what you're eating, my man. Don't talk to my ballo friend like that. Oh, let's look over here. This Roshi here looks great, Grease. You know, it's not the origin tree or anything, but it does a job. I like what you did with the branches. Huh, thanks, kid. You know, you're all right. <laughs> Let's save here, right? We want to... Well, let save at the... At the ship. Let's talk. Imperial troopers must have combed this area clean. The Empire is picking up where it left off after rolling over Saw's forces. Hopefully they all made it out alive. I bet most did. 
They're smart. I may not understand Saw's goals, but he did lay a blow to the Empire here. They slowed down operations. Slowing down is one thing, but what we're doing will end them for good. I hope you're right. I thought we had a victory here. Right now, it doesn't look like it. That doesn't mean you didn't save lives. War changes all the time. I'm sure you remember that from your time in the Clone Wars. Maybe. Or maybe this was all a bad idea. Saw's gone. The Empire's back. Saw may have known what he could and couldn't accomplish. He's been fighting the Empire for a long time. It's hard to see what we did accomplish. The refinery is destroyed. The Wookiees were freed. Saw knew there was no way he could liberate an entire planet. He did what he could and left when he couldn't do any more. To fight another day. We need to do more. We're trying, Cal. Excuse me, Cal. I'm working. Let's go talk to our buddy here. Nature is just so dirty. I hate this planet. You know, you try to keep a place clean, and then you guys bring me here. Place smells like damp Wookiee fur. Is that really the worst of your problems? Well, if you haven't noticed, I don't really have a lot left. But I still got pride. I've always believed in my pride. It's good to believe in something. The more I clean, cook, whatever little thing I can find, it's a victory to get it done, you know? I can see that. I know we've had a few bumps and bruises. I mean, some of them are kind of my fault. But I tend to focus on the little victories. Like, for one thing, we all have full stomachs. You make sure of that. You miss us, but. I miss more than that, kid, but... I'm still alive and I still got my ship. Gotta be grateful about that. That's true. You know, when I first got the Manus, some called it a piece of junk. It's held up so far. Yeah, it has. Not a bad sign. I clean, the droid messes it up. Is that how it's gonna be all the time? <laughs> Are we done talking? Okay. We're going to now a new I'm territory. Great. Hate sitting around like this. Dothmore. Setting course for death. Wait a minute. You want to go Dothmore. to Dothmere? Dothmere. 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 You must have had good reason. I am staying put on the Manus once we arrive. Red sunlight cannot be good for your skin. This place used to be home to a powerful cabal of force wielders known as the Night Sisters. They use the force? What, like Jedi? No. These witches serve only themselves. Their powers focused on deception, illusion, manipulation. <laughs> Sounds like someone I used to know. During the Clone Wars, the Night Sisters made a deal with a Sith Lord who betrayed their trust. In the end, they were nearly wiped out in a massacre. Dathomir is a deadly place. We should be careful. You don't have to tell me twice. The Night Sister of Dothamir were a coven of powerful force sensitive skilled in the use of magic an expression of the force unknown to the Jedi or Sith. They previously ruled Dothamor. Night Slay Sister Society was strictly okay with the old coven answer the mother who also ruled the Lord. Night Brother class, their civilization was destroyed at the behest of vengeful Count Daku after Asajj Ventress and her sisters attempted to assassinate him. Ah, coming up on our creepy destination. <clears throat> Grab some seat, kid. Seat grabbed. Dothamir. Doors, I got walls, I got Jedi, I'm fine. Yeah. Hey, Cal, you and her. Is everything all right? I don't know. That's not what's important right now. You know, Seer believes in you. And to tell you the truth, I didn't really think that much of you at first. I noticed. I mean, she got me to follow you to the scariest place in the galaxy, so, you know. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Well, I hope you two can sort this thing out soon so we can finish this quest and go relax somewhere. 
I know a great castle on Taco Donna that makes the best bloody rancors in the galaxy. Have you seen Seer? What? Is this a trick question? You want me to go outside and find her for you? No, it's okay. I'll find her. You gotta quit messing with me, Cal. I mean, I'm tough, but fragile. So, looks like Sork Tormo really wants a piece of you. Huh. You don't know the half of it, kid. How'd you ever get involved with that guy? Look, I didn't grow up with much. I mean, I had my great-grandmother to lean on, but that's it. You had to know it wouldn't end well with gangsters like the Haxian Brood. Cal, we ain't all Jedi. Most of us got to scrape by and occasionally make some bets we wish we hadn't. I understand. You can count on me if the brood comes after you again. Yeah? Huh. Thanks, Cal. Not now. I got work to do. Okay. Cal, do you have a moment? You've come a long way since Bracca, but the path is far from over. I want you to know the difficult challenges ahead. I can handle it. I know what you can do. I'm not denying that. And I know what has to be done. I've done it before. Cal, even the strongest of Jedi... I'm not Trilla. I'll be fine. I know you're not. I didn't say that. I'm not asking you to say anything. It's okay, Seer. Really. Just be safe, Cal. That's all. Hey, I know we haven't been on great terms, but can I talk to you about something? I need your help. I'm listening. I've reconnected with the Force, but I still feel blocked. Why do you think that is? Every time I open myself up, I see Master T'Pol. You felt this, yet you continue deepening your connection to the Force. You know what that says to me? That I don't know what's good for me. That you're strong enough to embrace your emotions. Give yourself time. Seer, I... Thanks for helping me. Means a lot. Bree's still hiding? Appears so. I don't blame him. Dathomir is not kind to outsiders. Cordova must have said something about this place to you. Something to explain why he came here. You think he was any more clear then than he is on those logs he left behind? He was always a smart man, but he was still figuring things out. Now it's up to us to follow that path. Let's talk later, Cal. All right. standing there. What is that thing? You wouldn't count on him being friendly. Bane back spider, capable of launching range attacks of venomous saliva on death corpse from a toxic acid. While Bane back spider is a venomous foe to be reckoned with, primary or whole dweller. They are known to be skitters and climb with agility. When encountered, they can project venomous saliva at enemies with range up to 12 meters. Caution should be taken if they are killed due to ammunition. Okay.
Need to know, don't you? What is it, BD? Oh, look at that. He matches me. Better. Burial pods. Burial pods were a central part of the Night Sisters' funeral rites. Writing each each component of a pod was a pain, painstaking practice. The cloth wraps were washed three times. The magical waters, the twine handed braided, while reciting a special protection. The body cleansed with fragile. Okay. Right. Come on, BD. Legend grows in dry, rocky areas. Air is filtered through its filament, or traps dust and bacteria. Once filtered, the filaments to contract it, lock clean air inside, creating a human environment where the hydrants can be observed. The small amount of water needs to survive. Okay. Him. Let me see. Laser Nadek. Uphold the strong defensive against its aggressive and relentless attacks, easily thrown by a repeated parries. Referred to in legends as the Scourge of Dothamore, the deadly Laser Nadek is an agile and highly aggressive alpha predator. Its chronovorous appetite and relentless pursuit of prey. Make a deadly foe to near all other life forms. Powerful arms allow it to traverse turns to diverse and unparalleled method. Often surprising its core. As I think, you know, like where are we supposed to go from here? <clears throat> Mushlings. The mushlings are an essential ingredient in the ink of Night Sisters, Night Brothers used for their tattoos. Mushing pods are boiled down until they become thick yellowish paste from their clay ash or other pigments. Or okay. I think it's sealed. Oh, okay, so there is like a little path this way. Essentially, we are supposed to go that one path. Okay. Well, at least we got this shortcut. In we go. Looks 
place seems abandoned, but... You trespass, Jedi. You must be a Night Sister. I had heard you were all dead. Not all. Dothamir is forbidden to you. Leave at once. Well, I'm afraid I can't do that, but perhaps we could help each other. You see, I... Easy. I'm not your enemy. Your actions say otherwise. Wait, hold on. I'm not here to... Who is this? A night sister. Night sister welding powerful magic threatened on Cal on Dathamore. Let's see how she escaped the massacre of her coven by her hatred for trespassers is obvious. The night sister immediately identified Cal as a threat and commanded the night brothers to attack. Say that again. Throw me a stim BD. Oh, great timing. Hmm. Okay, let's meditate. What do we want? We have three now. What's up here? Oh, we are gonna take that for sure. Chris is all lightsaber damage. Well, definitely. Um, delay combo. Switch attacks. Oh. Oh, lightsaber throw. That's how we can do it, too. We should definitely work on this. So. Okay, we need that for sure. Yeah, we'll definitely work on that next. Let us save here. All right, guys. What we'll do is uh, we will end this one off here and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Uh, thank you very much for it.